If you're a sky watcher or just someone who enjoys marveling at nature's beauty, get ready. Because this week, the night sky is putting on a show you won't want to miss. Two meteor showers, the Southern Delta Aquarians and the Alpha Capricornids, are peaking at the same time, creating what experts are calling a meteor shower double feature. On the night of July 29th into the early morning of July 30th, these two showers will be at their peak. And if that wasn't exciting enough, early activity from the famous Perseid meteor shower will also be visible, offering even more shooting stars to catch with your eyes or on camera. Let's start with the Southern Delta Aquariids. This meteor shower is active from around mid-July through early August, but it hits its highest point on July 29th and 30th. Under dark skies and ideal conditions, you might see between 15 to 25 meteors every hour. These meteors are typically fast-moving and faint, and while they don't usually leave long trails, their frequency makes up for that. Their radiant point, the area in the sky they appear to come from, is near the star Delta Aquarii in the constellation Aquarius. For the best viewing, you'll want to look toward the southern sky just before dawn, when the constellation is high. Now let's talk about the Alpha Capricornids. This shower doesn't produce as many meteors, typically around 5 per hour, but what it lacks in quantity, it makes up for in brilliance. Alpha Capricornid meteors are slower and often appear as bright, colorful fireballs that can leave long-lasting trails. These meteors come from the constellation Capricornus, and they're best viewed after midnight when the radiant is higher in the sky. Their rare, dramatic fireballs are what make this shower special. What makes this night so unique is that both showers peak on the same night, giving you the chance to witness a combined spectacle of frequent fast meteors and occasional slow, bright fireballs all under one sky. If you're lucky, you might see 20 to 30 meteors per hour in total, depending on your location and sky conditions. Adding to this cosmic event is early activity from the Perseid meteor shower. While the Perseides won't peak until mid-August, some of their meteors are already visible. This year, their peak around August 12th and 13th might be hampered by a bright moon, so catching some early Perseides now could actually be your best shot at seeing them clearly. The Perseides are known for their fast, bright meteors and can produce up to 100 meteors per hour during their peak. So, when and where should you watch? Your best bet is between midnight and dawn, especially in the pre-dawn hours when Aquarius and Capricornus are high in the sky. The moon will be in a waxing crescent phase, only about 25 to 27 percent illuminated, and it sets early, meaning you'll have a mostly dark sky to enjoy. That makes this an excellent opportunity for viewing, especially in areas away from city lights. Find a dark, open location, ideally far from street lights or buildings. Lie back, give your eyes about 30 minutes to adjust to the darkness, and look up. You won't need binoculars or telescopes. Just your own eyes and a bit of patience. Avoid looking at your phone screen during this time, as it can disrupt your night vision. Whether you're a seasoned stargazer or just stepping outside for a few minutes, this is a rare chance to see multiple meteor showers blending into one breathtaking show. Two peaks on the same night, combined with a dark sky and the bonus of early Perseides, means this is one of the best nights of the year for meteor watching. So mark your calendar, set an alarm, and look up. The universe is ready to put on a dazzling display. You just have to show up and watch.